In this video, we are going to explore what is science, what is a scientist, the different types of scientists, and the scientific method. So what is science? Well, science is a way of organizing what we already know and learning more by experiments. Science began as a search for knowledge that arose out of a need for survival. For example, early hunters studied the habits and variety of animals they hunted. They discovered the uses of plants and herbs as food and medicine, and worked out how to make use of natural substances such as metals and minerals. By experimenting with these materials, people developed ways to improve the quality of their lives. You've probably heard of scientists, but what exactly do they do? Scientists are people who gather knowledge about the world and how it works. Scientists are people who ask questions and find different ways to answer them. They are very curious people who like to solve problems. They solve these problems by doing science projects called experiments. Here is a look at just a few of different types of scientists. A cytologist is a scientist who studies cells. A biologist is a scientist who studies living things. A botanist is someone who studies plants. A marine biologist is a scientist who studies organisms and ecosystems in the marine environment. A geologist studies the rocks and the earth. An astronomer studies everything in space, such as suns, moons, stars, and galaxies. A chemist studies composition of matter and its properties. A microbiologist looks at microorganisms such as bacteria, viruses, algae, fungi, and some types of parasites. A biochemist is a scientist that studies chemical processes in living organisms. A seismologist is an earth scientist who studies earthquakes and seismic waves. A lab technician works in a laboratory carrying out research or experiments. A meteorologist looks at weather and climates. A physicist studies matter, energy, and how they are related. An anthropologist is a scientist who studies the development and behaviors of human beings throughout the world, present and past, to better understand humanity as a whole. An agronomist is a scientist who specializes in soil and crops and the study of agriculture. A geneticist studies how traits are inherited. And an epidemiologist looks at the spread of a disease, whether it's a virus or bacteria. Today we depend on science and scientists for many things, from keeping our air clean to curing people when they have certain diseases. So what do scientists do specifically? Well, it all boils down to observing, testing, and communicating, all of which make up the scientific method. So what exactly is the scientific method? Well, the scientific method is a way for scientists to study and learn things. It consists of certain steps, and each of these steps is very important. 1. Ask a question. 2. Do your background research. Formulate a hypothesis or a prediction, which is an educated guess of what you want to study. 4. Design an experiment. 5. Test the hypothesis or the prediction. 6. Analyze the data or the results. And lastly, draw a conclusion, which is where you decide whether or not the results support the prediction. Science is all about getting answers to questions. Why? When? Where? What? Who? So what kind of scientist do you think you might like to be? Think about what interests you. Are you curious? Do you have careful observation? Are you a logical thinking person? Are you creative? Are you open-minded? Or are you skeptical? Well guys, there's more than a whole world of science, since you might even be studying things far beyond our Earth. Dream big because there's a scientist in everyone.